Hi, welcome to ATI's troubleshooting video on how to replace a ballast in your SunPower T5 fixture. So to do this, what you're going to need is 2mm Allen wrench, small flathead screwdriver, a pair of pliers, a Phillips screwdriver, the correct replacement ballast, and a small Ziploc bag for your screws so you don't lose them. So first off, what you want to do is Remove all these screws. There's two down the side, there's two on the end. Second, you want to remove the fan. There's a video on that if you are not aware on how to do that. And third, you want to take some blue masking tape and place it around this black plug, like so. So it's completely around the plug. So, and what you have as a final result is the fixture completely covered so you don't scratch it. You can remove the end plates, set them aside, remove the fan, and you take your pliers. Get a good grip on the plug, squeeze it, and slowly maneuver it out. Next what you want to do is remove this black piece. And just slide the cover all the way up. There you go. Next step is to locate the ballast that is not operating correctly and you should know which one it is by the previous video. You marked which two bulbs do not fire. So, these two are marked. These two. That would be these two. Follow the wires to the ballast. It's this ballast right here. So, the next step, take your replacement ballast, set it right next to it, grab your small flathead screwdriver, and one by one, remove a wire, and install the wire in the same spot on the new ballast. Go step by step so you do not wire the new ballast incorrectly and co possibly cause it to fry itself. If you ever get confused or lost you have that second ballast so you can look and see how it's wired. There's also a wiring diagram on the ballast. But for the most part, if you go slow, pay attention. It's a very simple process. There you go. You got one side wired up. Come over to the other side. Pull out one. Install the next one. Pull out the next one and install it there and there you go halfway done next step grab your Phillips screwdriver and now it's time to remove the faulty ballast take your screw put it aside it's also a washer in here come to the other side Remove the screw, remove the washer, remove the ballast, slide your new one in place, and just do the exact opposite to reinstall it.
There we go. After that, check out your connections. Make sure there's no more uh, issues anywhere. Now that you got your fixture apart, go ahead and give it a good cleaning. If you need to, this one is fine. After that, slide it back into the frame. The exact way that you slid it back out. Feed the wire through. And reinstall everything in the exact reverse. Plug goes back here. Push that back in there. Install your fan and your end caps. And what you'll end up with is a working fixture. Fill out the tape. There should be no more screws left in your bag. Everything should be working. And that's how you replace a ballast in an ATI sun power fixture.